Once upon a time, there was a little girl named Mary. Mary loved to play outside and have fun. One beautiful day, when the sun was shining brightly in the sky, Mary was playing in her backyard. She was running around, jumping and skipping. Suddenly, Mary stopped and looked up. She saw a big, fluffy thing in the sky. It was so big and white, it looked like a pillow. Mary giggled with excitement. Mommy, mommy, she shouted. Come quick, there's a giant pillow in the sky. Mary's mommy came outside and looked up. She saw the big, fluffy thing that Mary was talking about. Oh, Mary, her mommy said. That's not a pillow. It's a cloud. No, mommy, Mary said. It's a pillow. It looks so soft and fluffy. I just want to cuddle with it. Mary's mommy smiled. Okay, Mary, she said. Let's pretend it's a pillow for now. Mary was so happy. She ran over to the tree that was next to the pillow cloud and climbed up. When she reached the top of the tree, she stretched out her arms and hugged the cloud. The cloud was soft and fluffy, just like a pillow. Mary closed her eyes and took a deep breath. She could smell the fresh air and feel the warm sun on her face. She felt so happy and peaceful. Mary and the cloud pillow played together for hours. They played hide and seek, they sang songs, and they even had a pillow fight. Mary had so much fun with her new cloud friend. She didn't want to go inside, but the sun was starting to go down. I have to go now, Mary said sadly. But I'll come back tomorrow to play again. Mary climbed down from the tree and waved goodbye to the cloud pillow. The cloud pillow waved back. Mary skipped happily inside to tell her mommy all about her adventure. Mommy, mommy, Mary said. I played with a cloud pillow today and it was the best day ever. Mary's mommy smiled. I'm so glad you had fun, sweetheart, she said. But remember, clouds are just clouds. They can't turn into pillows, Mary nodded. I know, mommy, she said. But in my imagination, it was a pillow, and that's all that matters. The next day, Mary went outside to play again. She looked up at the sky and smiled. There was her cloud pillow, still fluffy and white. Mary waved to the cloud, and the cloud waved back. Mary knew that no matter what, the cloud pillow would always be her friend. Because in her imagination, it was real and imagination is the most powerful thing in the world.